Shoo! Before we get in, I gotta let you know that Beefcake Jerky is back in stock. Link down below right now and right now only for probably like the next like five minutes, okay? If you're watching as soon as I post this video. If you wanna try it, try it right now. It's probably gonna sell out. Okay, now that I've told you that, and for the people that really, really, really wanted it, hopefully they're at the website right now, not watching this video, and they're buying it, because otherwise it's gonna be gone. I'm gonna explain to you guys why this most recent drop is just jerky, and there's not a lot of it. I mean, there's there's a decent amount of it, but not like as much as our last drop. And here's why. I am in the, this is the new brainstorming room here, okay? We upgraded, okay? We were over, I don't know where the light switches are, but we're in the warehouse right now. This was the office that we all crammed into, that you guys saw some content, so this is like, yeah, this is where we do all the orders and stuff. If you're new here, I guess I'll give you a quick little, just quick, we're gonna get right to fishing, I promise, the video's worth it. And then here, that's the warehouse. Lucy, come here, she's the supervisor. So we got the warehouse, some new packing stations. Come here, girl, come on, come back in. So tonight we're gonna be spending some time doing some packing, but um, we ended up getting a huge conference table for the conference room, and now that's pretty much where we work, which is actually really nice. So this is the brainstorming room, it's where we kind of figure out all the stuff. I can't show you a whole lot of it, but here's the reason why Here's the reason why there's a short order that of our smaller order is we're coming out with new flavors. With new flavors means new bags. With new bags means redesigned bags that make more sense. And so right now we just had like beef original or original just written in orange and then we had teriyaki in white and like we didn't want to have all the text wouldn't always look good on the background. So we wanted to make sure all the bags are color coded per the flavor, okay? So like beef could be like big and orange, okay? Maybe teriyaki's purple. Uh, and so what happened was we had extra bags. So when you order the bags, they make the meat, they fill the meat in the bags, but they don't always fill every single bag because they just make certain, like bat, like a batch of meat, it'll vary how many bags it, it can fill. So we order more bags than we think that we're gonna need, so that way they don't make too much meat and have no bags to put them in because then we have a bunch of loose banjos meat. Nobody likes banjos loose meat, okay? So, but what happened was we ordered too many bags for the last run. Basically, they batched it all up, they make it all, and we have leftover bags. So, since we have new bags coming in, we have old bags, and I'm like, we, we gotta get rid of the old bags before we put, put, launch the new bags. That's something that makes sense. So, we convinced the factory to just make a small batch to basically fill the old bags, so that way they're gone, so when we get new bags and new flavors, that we don't have like this like jumbled mess, if that makes any sense. So that's why we have a small run of bags, but I'll give you guys a sneak peek right now. This right here, these are the new bags. So you've got beef original, pork teriyaki, pork honey barbecue, and beef blank, okay? That's gonna be the, the following one. This one's coming out first. This is gonna be in the August drop. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be the guy to say it, but this might be better than this. I'm just well, saying, I'll I'm say just saying. It is my favorite, hands down. It is so good. There, there's a chance, there's a chance. And, and, and dare I say, dare I say, this, this this beef right here is is might be better than this one. I'm just gonna say I'm just gonna say there's there's a chance that we're getting our flavors even more down than what they already are. So if you like what we already have, if you try the original, you try the teriyaki, just wait till you put honey barbecue and then the beef blank in your mouth. It's amazing. So these are our new colored bags. Those are the samples that just came in, and so we've got all the bags that are getting ordered right now coming in, and then we're gonna send them off to the factory, and the factory's gonna fulfill them, and we're gonna have some uh, new flavors and new bags. So if you are gonna order this next round or you already ordered on the previous rounds, you're gonna have some vintage OG bags that will probably never be sold again. Like a collector's item type thing, Banjo. What's going on there? Lucy's helping me work. Really? Yeah. So uh, that's the plan. I just wanna give you guys a backstory so you don't think, cause I've got some comments like, Flair, why don't you just buy like a million bags so then you don't sell out? First off, Rick, it takes money to make money and we ain't got a lot of it right now. We're working on it, okay? Two, it's a bag situation. So once these bags are gone, the website will go sold out again, and in probably like two weeks or so, we should be restocked with a ton of new products, like way more bags than we've ever had, plus a new flavor, honey barbecue, with some new bundles and some stuff like that. Can you give um, a sneak peek of the, of what? Some cool merch or not? What, where's the new merch? Oh, oh yeah, we could show them that. All right, so here's what you got coming in August. Partnering up with Guggen Baits, okay, Guggen Squad, Guggen Baits. So we've got the Guggen Bundle right here. This is the Honey Barbecue Bundle right here. This is another Guggen Bundle, okay. You get a little tackle box, a bunch of jerky, a Guggen hat, some baits, a koozie. And then this is one of the bigger bundles here with a bunch of jerky, like a ton of jerky. So that's what you gotta look forward to August. We've got September up there, which I'm not gonna reveal quite yet. Um, we've got more collaborations, and then we've got October and some other stuff. So. 
that's the plan. Give you guys a quick update. But that's why. I just wanted to let you guys know why we have such a small run. It's not because we just want to sell out in nine seconds. I mean, it's great, but I'd rather sell out later and sell more bags. We just don't have enough bags. So sooner than later, we're going to have new bags, new colors, new flavors. You guys stay tuned. Welcome back, folks. That's right. We are going to be doing some dangling a little bit later. We're actually going to be taking Brooklyn out on her very first ever dangle adventure. Believe it or not, she's actually never been fishing. Can you believe that? You've gone all this time and you've not been fishing. <laughs> what are you, like the shades. You like those? What are you thinking? You driving? Do you have a matching pair? I should get a matching pair. Cool. That would be pretty sweet, actually. Yeah. But we are going to be. Yeah, what do you see? Pointed at Ralph. Ralph, you see Ralph? Do you see Ralph's swimming pool? Do you think Ralph's used a swimming pool? We aren't sure. So we are gonna be taking little Brooklyn fishing today. We're hopefully gonna go dang up some big old bass. That's actually the plan. Go back to the roots, get some bass going, and show her what it's all about, and hopefully catch some fish, and just keep it not... You wanna go dangling too? Well, there's not enough room on the boat, okay? But hopefully to show what it's about, catch some fish, get a reaction to it, and you know, hopefully it turns into something that we can do more and more often, especially with the backyard pond. That's obviously the plan. What are you thinking? That's the plan. Go and do a sufficient. But we had to come check on our boy's swimming pool. How, how many laps have you been doing? I saw you doing the old brass stroke this morning. Hey, 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 <laughs> easy, easy. Wow. How's it? You like the swimming pool, Ralph? Have you been using it? Has anyone else been using it? Has anything died in it? Do I have so many questions? Can't we gotta get, let's see. Yeah, oh, there it is. That's about what I expected. I'm gonna take a dookie in here. Ralph? I'm going Dale. Get in, Ralph. Let's see it. I want to see it. What are you pissed about right now? Ralph, get in. Let's see it. I wonder if anyone else has actually used this sucker. It's, yeah, I mean, it looks about like I was anticipating. I mean, Just a I think the ducks or something's been in it. I mean, there's, there's feathers. There's feathers. There's feathers. You think the ducks like it? Mm. I mean, they might They might like it. Ralph, get in. Let's Jeez, see it. Cool. I say, that's, we, we need to get some. I've been seeing some TikToks, okay? People getting some minnows and some goldfish, which is supposed to keep the algae down. And especially like the, the mosquitoes and stuff. In fact, fun fact, that's actually why Florida, well, I would say that's why Florida's good at good fishing. But all those like roadside canals, the reason why the bass are so good, be they put the bass in there to eat the mosquitoes and it's gotcha. for mosquito control. Yes, yeah, so that's why TikTok, they do that. The dude just put koi in there. His like really? cattle ponds. Because like all the little ones were getting eight. Oh, so really? Koi in there. Hey, how you doing, Ralph? I like how Winnie's up high like that. Yeah, I feel he's like so he's. Tall. What do you think? You want to get in Ralph's swimming pool? Oh, really? Okay, well, we probably need to clean it out first, but I have yet to see him actually go for a swim, nor have I seen him damp, okay? He's always just been dry as a hair desert, and he just kind of sits there. Still itching from the, the, the flies, which I figured at some... Hey, hey, easy, Ralph. Easy. Is, he, is Ralph sniffing? What do you think? You excited to go fishing? Okay. So, Ralph's swimming pool, nothing's died in it. I feel like that's part, that's like, a, like 50% of our project. That's half a win. win. No one's died. The other half win would be if Ralph would actually get in there and lay down. I feel like that would help. But so far, we haven't seen him actually step foot in it. I haven't seen any animals step foot in it. But I mean, they all they all congregate around it. It's like it's a little, a it's a community watering hole. But I think that might be all it is, Ralph. So we might need to go get some goldfish or some minnows or some type of koi of some sort. To hopefully try to keep this thing a little bit clear, more clear. So there's no algae issues, maybe eat the mosquitoes and stuff like that. Again, last thing we need is this yeah, thing to breed. Let's go. Plays in hey! That one. Come down in the pool. Ralph, Ralph, I was trying to explain to the duck over, why? There's a duck over there playing in the actual water trough, but not over, like, I'm surprised we don't come down and the ducks aren't, I guess Muscovy's, yeah, no, they're, they're, sm they're water dwelling things. They can swim. They can, I mean, they can definitely swim. I don't know if they, I Ew. typically see them on land, I'll be honest, what's, what? Yeah, that donkey just peed, Ralph's about it. Ralph, Drink Ralph, it. Ralph, no, Ooh. Ralph, oh, no, uh, no, 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 Ralph, no, Ralph, no, put it away, put it away, Ralphie. Why does he do? Do goats do that too? Do you remember? Yeah, no. Do you remember yeah. Felipe? Yes. Felipe Karen. used to piss on his own mouth and go. <laughs> he loved when Karen. And he would and, and, and he would yeah Karen would be peeing and he would just go he would slurp it up and then go. Yeah. I don't. What's what, the what, what is that? What is what's the lip? He ah, got God. it on his nose. Ah, dude, ah, the smell. These like flies are biting. It. Ralph, I can't pet your face anymore. That's disgusting. I didn't know you guys were like that. I don't know. You guys have you guys have to. Did I give him a kiss? Yeah, with the carrot. You guys. Oh, I shared a carrot with Ralph. Oh, rip. That's a bad deal. Ralph, I don't like what I just saw. Wash, wash out yeah, your mouth. You get away from here. Oh, give him right a kiss. There. Give him right a kiss. There. You get away. Give, give him a kiss. Give him a kiss. Come here, Ralph. Give him a kiss. I, I don't know. You guys, comment down below. What's the lip thing? Why? Like, it's obviously just like a natural, instinctual. Are they, are they putting their lips up so they can smell it better? Like, give it the good sniff. 
Maybe it's one of those things. I have no idea. But anyways, an update on the swimming pool is it's it's doing a, about exactly what I thought, which is uh, generates pond scum and fly larva and nothing else. But again, yeah, like what? Greg, get in the pool, bro. Get in the pool. Do you like the pool, Greg? George. George. <laughs> George, get in the pool, Greg. George. Come on, Greg. Greg, don't have a have a lot. Like, how many ducks do we? How many geese do we have? How many ducks do we have? And none of them like the pool. I don't like, yeah, I don't I, I'm, I'm genuinely confused. Nope. Carlos, explain this to me. <laughs> hey, hey, what are you doing? You, you just tried yeah, he doing just tried something. To bite you. Hey, <laughs> no. With that pee. That's oh, a bad God. boy. <laughs> Anyways, that's your update on this. Nothing else is really going on. We still don't have any piglets, okay? Or, or, or should we go see Debbie? You guys are concerned for Debbie's health, okay? I don't think any of you guys have had pigs before because Debbie's a very average looking and functioning pig. Some commenters, okay, said, Flair, why don't you put Debbie out there on the pasture? Do you know what pigs do? Not that, okay? Even though these are coonies, and technically coonies are the only breed of pig that will graze on pasture, they don't move a whole lot, okay? That's oh just, my God. that's you just, see this? what's going on here? Look at this nest. Someone landing Yeesh. eggs. Whoa, hang on, hang on. Oh, oh, hang on, we got another problem. What's that? Oh, no. Egg. Holy smokes. Oh, there's another broken one in there. Holy smokes. Who thought, who thought that was a good idea to put them in the coop? You got a $10,000 coop for a reason. What, what's this, why would you lay there? You have the coop. You have the coop. I don't understand that. I blame you. What do you think? Why the eggs like that? What are they doing? So I'm curious, do you think a predator actually cracked him or do you think another chicken? We have a we have an egg eating chicken? Nice. I think it's him. Kill him. I'm just kidding. Alright, we're not going Just imagine right there's ring his neck right on the right on the spot. Yeah, we ask questions later, pal. Okay. But Debbie, Debbie's hanging out in the shade. This by the way, this sucker. This chicken? I don't know if he's gonna make it. My favorite chicken. Can he, we name this one? He can't fly. No. Okay. Look at his tail. His his awareness is is not non existent, actually. But he's nice. He is like, like this had to have been somebody's house pet. Can we put it in your house? N no, definitely not. You can take, take it to your house, house though. Yeah, I still put it in the banjo crib. I live in city limits, can't have chickens. No, you can definitely have chickens. Think I feel like he lays blue eggs because of that thing. That I, thing don't lay I eggs. I feel like, yeah, I don't know what he does. I'm not sure why he's got. Is that a he's band? He's banded. I say he's got a band. Oh, we got a banded. Should we look him up? Where do you think he's from? Canada. Canada? Yeah. Should we mount him? Mount him. We probably shouldn't do that. We probably, we probably shouldn't mount him. That thing, he's he's slow. He's not agile. They cut his flight feathers. He is not a, he, he will not do good out in the wilderness. So all I know is if that thing's still alive, that means our raccoons are not prevalent. I mean, yeah. he'd be the first one to go out. So if yeah. we lose the silky, we know that it's probably game over and the raccoons are in fact back. But Big Deb, you guys, like I said, are concerned about Debbie's health for some odd reason. Debbie has lived her best life, okay? You wanna go see Deb? Hey, come here. Yeah. Let's go find Deb. Yeah, watch out where you're. Watch where you're walking here. Debbie, get up. Debbie, how's life been? You've been having a good time, Deb. Everyone's concerned about your health. She looks like a very healthy pig to me. She just sleeps. You want to pet Deb? Yeah. Is Deb soft? Debbie's kind of soft. What do you think, buddy? What do you got dangling here? The flies are. For the most part, the flies are staying off her ears, which is mm -hmm. good. No, oh, shake it off, Deb. You like your ear scratched or what? There it is, Deb. Don't you just want a power washer? Yeah. I just want to just. I want to give her a good scrub. What do you think? You want you don't you tired of Deb? You want to leave? Okay, she's over Deb. Deb, you keep doing Deb things. Theodore, what are you doing? Look, you like his new house? Oh, he's just big chilling. Theo, look at the new crib, Theo. We moved him over here. That way he'd be a little closer to mama. We noticed mama, they, she keeps going through these spells where like she gets all antsy. She's she's not the most friendly rabbit I've ever had. Theo is the most friendly by far. She just gets all like weird and antsy and then he was getting a little antsy. So I didn't know like, we don't know if she's pregnant still. We have no idea if she's gonna have babies. I don't know if there's like this intuition thing where she can communicate to her, him. She's about to have babies, even though technically you don't want him in there when she has babies. So we got them closer so they can at least smell each other. Did you see that Theo cleaned off his little treat stick? Oh yeah, he did eat that sucker. I didn't, I didn't notice that. Theo, you need some, you need some more treats, buddy. All right, you want to go pet Theodore? Okay. Say hi, Theodore. You shooting blanks, buddy? I haven't seen any babies. What do you think? You like him? You want to pet him? You really like them sunglasses, yeah. don't you? You do like them. Like, I'm surprised she's leaving them on. It's actually kind of impressive. You want to pet him? Is he soft? Oh, he's so soft, huh? You like him, huh? So yeah, we built him this little 
basically it's just if it's pouring rain or something we've got some tin around this thing and it's shaded and whatnot and then you saw in some previous videos we put some wood here so he can't dig up under it but this little thing works out good you can tell he likes it i mean mm -hmm. he, it's a, like a little enclosure and if we end up keeping theo through the winter we can get something similar to this but we can actually insulate it throw a little heater in here big theo he is just the nicest rabbit he is how are them ears doing Your ears still holding up oh yeah Oh, yeah. Nice and clean. Yeah, that is nice and clean. That's pretty impressive. Well, Theo's doing Theo things. Big, big Sheila. I don't even see Sheila. Oh, yeah. Sheila's just doing Sheila things. We're opening one of these days she has babies. We keep putting them together for like three days at a time and then leaving them apart for like 30 days. What do you want? Do you yeah. mean, do you want me to pet him? Or do you want him out? Do you mean to pet him? Do you want me to, you want me to pull? Wow. <laughs> she get says, him get him out. You want to, you want me to hold him? Theo, do you don't really look like you're in a mood to get really help? Chill right like, now. How about we just pet him where he's at? Theo, I feel really bad. Theo is just big chilling. Wake up, Teddy. You want to pet him? You can pet him the way he's at. I don't need have to hold him. I feel bad disturbing him. He just looks really comfortable right Midday now. nap time. All right, can you say goodbye? You say bye, Theodore. Say bye, Theo. All right, should we go fishing? That's the, that's the real question. You ready for the dangle, the ultimate dangle. So we're gonna head out and we're going to try to catch some bass, hopefully some big ones. Uh, first, we gotta stop our Walmart and Brooklyn's gotta pick out her own rod, reel, line, lure, all the good stuff. Let her pick everything she wants. Go out and give it a dangle and see if she can catch her very first fish. We'll see you guys at Walmart. Shoo, what's going on folks? If we gotta stop at Walmart first to get little shoe her own fishing pole. What do you think? Should we go find a fishing rod? You never been, yeah, she's never been fishing before. We have not taken her out yet. And I was like, you know what? It's finally not 2000 degrees out. It's like 75, feels great. Fish are biting. And I feel like she's she's gotten old enough now to, well, obviously she's not gonna be able to go, you know, start skipping docks or anything, but casting and you know, me, I, I will probably be doing most of the casting and setting the hook. There's a chance if I'm fighting a fish, she would hang on to the pole. If I continue to do the reeling, I don't really know. I don't know the extent of it. Again, I don't expect a whole lot, but at the end of the day, we want to go out, we want to catch some fish, show her what it's all about so she can see what we do when we go out there and we go fishing. We go out, we catch some fish, we have a good time. Uh, I don't know if we're going to do catching cooks. We're going to be mostly targeting large mouth mostly going after some big bass the lake we're going to i've heard has giant giant bass so our goal today is to break brooklyn's pb which at this point is anything because she's never caught a fish so no matter what today we're going to break her pb like i said more, more importantly we're going to go into walmart we're going to get a whole rod a whole reel a whole setup we got all the gook and baits that we need already packed in the truck we're going to head out we're going to get on the pontoon boat and get to dangling you guys stay tuned all righty folks we are making our way to the fishing aisle it's time for brooklyn here to select some some lure, we, if you want some lures, you can have some lures. We got a bunch of Guggen stuff, but you want to find some baits? You got to find some rods and reels too. You got to get some that you can cast. Hey, back over this way. Little shoe, you need this one? Nah, you don't like that. Look, the cane it. pole action. Not a, run. Not about it. You want to find a rod? Go, go find, go find a pole. Oh, there it is. Okay, well, okay. Here's our options. You ready for this? Let's see, we got Barbie. Oh, she she's a big Moana guy. Does she like Minecraft? No. Really? That no. actually is kind of cool. Uh oh. You see, you see Moana? Is it this one? All right. Which one? I told you she's a big Moana <laughs> guy, dude. She's a big Moana guy. You love Moana? Is, is that Moana? What about Minecraft? No. No. Which one? Is Frozen? Oh. Yeah, you, you've seen Frozen a couple times. You're, you're a huge Moana guy. Okay, which one? You pick one. Oh, that pink camera. All right, oh, yeah. She, <laughs> she wants it. She's, she's about, you want this one? We gonna make it? Are we gonna be all right? Big Junior crying. <laughs> go, cheer, go cheer him up, Big Junior. Come on now. Oh shoot! Should we get a tackle oh, box? Oh, she's about it. Box? You want a you want a tackle box? They have Moana one. No, no Moana. Red. She's just not that good. I guess. Yeah. All right, pick one. All right, uh, we're going with frozen. frozen. Okay, all right. All right, here, Andrew, take this guy. All right. We're, this is just gonna be an options thing. Yep. This right. or that. Wh which one? All right, we're Blue. getting that net. All right, go go pick out some other stuff. What else do you want? More nets. More, hey, we only need one. How many fish do you think you're gonna catch? All of them. Right, we'll pick out some bobbers. Which one? You want a blue one? Or do you want a pink one? No. Oh, you want that big one? Lights it up. Lights up. The water. We would go for the expensive one. Banjo put you up to that? Rattle or trap. Yeah. <laughs> you, the old trap. What about this one here? That is that what you want? Really? Oh, no. <laughs> We're gonna play a game. Take it. We open it. All right. This is the good stuff. Okay, go put more in there. 
Can you put more in there? Nope. Can you, can you put more baits in there? Hey, find more. Find some more baits. You put it in there. Yeah. Yeah. Put it in the box. See, that's what I'm yeah, saying. The old she, bug. She gets it. She says the bandy bug bugs. The only bait you need. Ready to go. You good? You mean you mean latch it? All right. You ready to hit the lake? Here, you take it. All right. You got it. See, we already have all this stuff, so I'm not gonna buy it. Leave it for the next guy. There you go. Did you make him look nice. Come on, yeah. man. You're organizing. Oh, there you go. Did you put a hey? Did you put a bobber in there? Hey, that's hey, what I'm hey, saying. Hey, there hey, it is. Hey, All right, go find it. something else. What else do you want? Brooklyn. Should we go find some? Here, do you want some worms? Look. Aww. You want those kind? Should I see if they're all deceased or not? There's there nothing you in there. Yeah, dirt. You want a jar of dirt? I mean, those will work. work. Yeah, those work. Canadians are probably a little bigger. Yeah, yeah. they definitely. You want this one? All right, can you put it in? Put it in. There it is. Perfect. All right, crawlers done. Let's find some hooks. I think all the small stuff's down here. She likes her fishing pole. Yeah. Yeah, we're getting it. Don't worry. All right, we'll get, we got some hooks. That's important. Maybe get a couple split shots if they got a small pack of them, ideally. Oh, yeah. They're, yeah I'm, they're more, going. I'm more about the 94 or the dollar 24. That'll work. What else do you want? You want this? Do you want that? You put it in. So, what else did you add? You put it in? Those are for the weights. You want to see your, you want to see your worms? You want to see them? What do you think about that? Put them back, she said. All right. I don't like that. Set that down right now. All right. Where'd your weights go? Where'd you she put, put them? in the middle trap. Hey, can you get your weights? Pick them back up. All right. Put them in. Put them in. Thank you. Security definitely thinks we're stealing right yeah. now. So I was like, yeah, I just got this, ma'am. I swear. Does. All right. What else do you need? Last call. All right. We're leaving the fishing out. This might get interesting. What else do you need? I'd say next thing she touches, you have to buy. All right. Next thing she touches, I buy. What do you need? You need something good. You're really thinking about this. She's taking this serious. Grab that $200. Oh, yeah. Where are you going? Oh, let's go. All right, I'll take it. That's gotta be, that thing's got to be cheap, right? All right, well, you want that? Okay, we'll take the football. That, of all things. Yeah, I was starting to sweat there for a second. She about went to the LG TV. It's about lost it. All right, you got everything you need? I think we're ready. We're going to hit the road. We're going to head to the lake, get the pontoon boat, and take Brooke on her very first fishing adventure. You guys, stay tuned. Shoo! Alrighty, we are out on the boat. How's that going? Watch your head. Look out. Watch Low head. clearance, buddy. Well, we're out on the boat, out on the lake. This is where we shot some nice big fish, Banjo. Yeah, we missed a lot. We missed an incredible amount. Way more than we actually hit. But good news, Banjo brought Macy a fresh pack. Macy didn't bring snacks for us, just Brooklyn. So, don't worry. I took a couple out of the glove box. We're they good. just got that glove box jerky. Yeah. Mmm, we're going to catch a four pounder. It's going to happen. What's the biggest bass you got out of this summer gun? 6'6 six, six this year. Holy smokes. What'd you catch it on? Uh, black and blue Senko. Really? You mean a lunker log? Yeah, that's yeah. what I mean. Yeah, that's, Actually, what I... that's what's on right now. Is it really? Yep, lunker log right Really? Now. All right, well, you want mine. A little wacky rig action? Oh, yeah. It's got a six pound on a wacky rig. Six pound, six pound. On that spinning rod, too? Uh-huh. Really? Yeah, really well, we're going to go ahead and we got... All the dangle noodles hooked up. We got a little crappie set up. We got the big old swim bait. We got a click bait. We got the new dupe tube. And then this is a wacky setup right here. We can do some wacky fishing. What's what's the strategy though? Sea walls? Is that, is that what they're about? Mm -hmm. No, no docks or no? Just sea walls? We catch them off the docks too, but really? sea walls probably all we'll need. We're gonna head out. <laughs> Brooklyn, you having fun yet? She's got a life jacket on. Safety first. Well, she may be more interested in the snacks than the fishing setup, but actually, speaking of fishing, I should probably get her stuff rigged up here before I should get your dangle noodles going. I got so concerned. I forgot this video was about her. I was like, see this contender we're going to be flipping? <laughs> we're going to catch a six pounder. <laughs> Me skipping this dock with this wacky rig. Meanwhile, yeah, this is all about the her. Moana setup going here. Yeah. Yo, Moana. See, what, oh, what's going on? How's that going? She wants this, is, this isn't our first time on a boat, is it? Yeah. Is it really? Yeah. Some reason I feel like we've been on a boat, maybe not. You want you want this? Okay, well I gotta get something tied on. All right, so we're gonna take this. What do you think? It's line strong? Nope. <laughs> All right, that will not catch a six yeah. pounder. No. Can I have a strawberry? Oh, thank you. Can you uh, give one to Austin. Give him a banjo. She says nothing for you, big junior. <laughs> oh, I got it. I got right. it. I got this designed for bluegill, just in case the bass don't co cooperate. But 
I think it'll, it'll work. What's, do you think it's the rattle for the kid or for the fish, do you think? The kid. The kid. You think so? I feel like a fish might get excited if they hear See? that. Yeah, it's definitely really kid. You think so? <laughs> no, don't Yeah, hey, we'll give her a shot. Here you go. That looks pretty good. Hey. Oh, yeah. See your worm? Is that, that's what we're going to use to fish. All right, well, we're going to cruise up to the spot and get to Dangon. You guys stay tuned. All right, boys, first cast. Brooklyn, are you ready? We're going to give her a deal one, two, see what Moana's got to say. Dang! Moana cat. Moana, look at that sucker. Sheesh. Yeah, you see your bobber out there. That's the idea. Yeah, that's the idea, though. Is it's, See, it's in the water, and then when it goes down, we bring it in. I was just testing the casting. That thing's pretty solid. So this is supposed to be where the juice is. is. Is the right side or left side any better, or what do you think? You it's all. Find out where the, they usually the big oh, they're schooled up. You're telling me. Oh, yeah. All right, Moana, here we go. Dude, I'm gonna train the baitcaster. Yeah. That ain't bad. Going back to the push button. Yeah. That's yours, Moana. All right, well, we'll give her a soak. We've got a couple of dangle noodles. We'll start flipping and pitching around. Apparently, they school up, so we got to find that school and then get broken on our first fish. You guys, stay tuned. All right, we 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 seen one. Bander, what do you what do you dang? Crappie rig. The ultralight. Yeah. Bander's gonna try to get it, get himself a little crappy. Uh, well, we gotta wait for the fish to bite. I mean. Yeah, it's gotta do it, son. In the shade too. Come on now. Uh, yeah, you yeah. see your bobber? There it is, Banjo. You got it. You like that? Oh yeah. Keep an eye on that banjo. You gotta get the big guns out. Big guns, baby. <laughs> Cover some water. Got the old clickbait. Brooklyn's rod's doing a dangle back there. I'm gonna whip the clickbait up. Yeah, hey, what are you dangling on that? Nothing. You retired? Just making sure the kid doesn't jump off the boat. <laughs> good call. That's a good call. Go. Going for the rod. You gonna bring it in? <laughs> you wanna cast that way? <laughs> You're casting the wrong spot, pal. Bring it in. Oh yeah, that'll be a real interesting if we hook a six pounder. Yeah. yeah, oh yeah. Six pounder roll. That'll be a doozy. All right, they don't want the moving bait. Got the dube tube. I'm gonna bring it out and give it a soak. All right, change my mind. We're going wacky. When in doubt, whack, whack it, out. it out, baby. Let's see it. There we go. She getting it figured out? Bring it in. There you go. All right, six pounder's not gonna stand a chance. Yeah, she's we, got yeah, it. Yeah, we got this. <laughs> You want to reel it in? <laughs> reel it in. Hey, easy, easy. Look out. <laughs> no, no. She's, I hate Moana. Just chucks it. Well, boys, no luck on the seawall. The only thing we could think of, because Devin's been out here giving it a dangle, and he was catching them. Now we're not. The only thing we could think of is it went from 95 every single day to like 70. I don't know what happens to fish during a cold front on a sand pit like this. There's nowhere for them to go. The only thing I can think of is, is if the surface temperature dropped, so they went a little deeper, which maybe they're sitting under some docks. We're gonna, we'll find something. You said, is there a beaver dam too? Yeah. Oh, the dam's definitely gonna have them. You guys stay tuned. Dude, oh, I'm telling you. We found some rocks. I'm thinking those will hold heat plus. As far as Brooklyn just catching a fish, I feel like bluegills on the rocks, pretty, pretty typical. So we're gonna let that thing marinate. We're gonna give her the old 2-1. I'm gonna throw the old the wacky one. lunky, huh? The, the old one-two. One, one, two. The old one-two. There it is. All right, she's dialed in. You're not, not messing around <laughs> right now. That's in the old limb, The old limb line, here we go. The old dam, dam did it. No seawall, no dam. What else run, you got up your sleeve? You run back to the shallow dock back here. <laughs> the fish literally disappeared. Flipping docks. You want to flip docks? I flip mean, the deep side of the dock. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, let me. I'll pitch the old dube in there. I feel like we might be on something. Yeah. Banjo, how's your flipping scales? Zero out of ten. Uh oh. Perfect. I mean. Come on now. <laughs> Oh, oh, man, damn, with the skip. Come on, now. They can't disappear, right? You can't just take an L like that. They're in this lake somewhere. I Brooke, just gotta... Brooklyn's never gonna want to go fishing ever again. Well, oh, boys, dock didn't work. Beaver dam didn't work. Seawall didn't work. You having a good time? You got your ball? At Throw in the water, Banjo will get it. What do you think? You got any bright ideas? I'm working on one, I think. Stay tuned. We on, boys. Oh, we God. on, boys. The seawall. The seawall. Brooklyn, you want to reel this sucker in? 
Come here, Brooklyn. Come here. Come here. Come bring it in. Oh, dude, he's pretty good. All right. Can you bring it in? You hold it. Here, here, you see the reel? Here, it's on this side. I know it's a lefty. Can you grab it? Oh, oh God. That's there you go. There you go. Bring it in. You got it. Keep grabbing. Here, here, keep doing it. Good job. Keep going. You don't want to reel? You want to hold the rod? Like... All right, you hold the rod. I'll reel. How about that? You grab the rod. Hold it. Oh, my God, dude, it's a tang, bro. It's a good fish. Come on. Get, get, bring it in. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, my God, he's huge. Okay, you're all right. It's okay. Good job. You, you want to see him? Yeah, look, he's coming. Look, he's down there. Oh, yeah. Oh. It's a tank. It's a tank, bro. Look here, bro. Right here. Right. Here. Oh, reel? oh my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, here, come here, Brooklyn. Come here. Here. We'll finish reeling him in. Come here. All right. You bring him in. Oh, yeah. He's got it. He's got it good, too. There you go. Reach over and lip him, Big Junior. Oh, you're, you're all right? Here, stand up. All right, Big Junior, you're on land duty? Yeah. All right, I got broken. We're good. Okay. <laughs> got a fish in one hand, a kid in another. The other. We're good. Here. Oh, yeah, he ate it good, too. Yeah. All right, we get your first fish. Yeah, where's the net, Brooklyn? <laughs> oh, God. Sheesh! Yo, there he is. You see your fish? Look at that sucker. Oh, yeah. Buddy ate it, gone dead. He hit it right as it right as it hit the water. You see your fish? Who do you think? Oh, he's slimy, huh? Yeah, that's a Is that funny? <laughs> Is that you see him? Is that pretty cool? Whoa, that's pretty crazy, isn't it? Look at that sucker. What do you think? First fish? Not on the Barbie rod, huh? I could put a wacky on that rod though. You good. I might have to. You see it? Is he, is, he, is he slimy? He ate it done good, boys. That was on the weightless hey. lunker log wacky rig. So I think I'm gonna put that on her yeah. rod. So I think she'll she'll be able to reel hers in a little bit better. You did pretty good. A couple couple rotations. We got him in. That's a solid fish too. That's I don't know. What do you think? You Four. Touch him I was gonna again? say probably three, three she and a half just maybe. Wants to touch him. You wanna touch him? You touch him. What do you think? No, no, no. Do you wanna put him back? All right, let's get him unhooked. Let's get him back in the water. Bye, I won't let fish. you go. You ready? You wanna touch him one last time? You give him a sniff like Rackley? No? <laughs> Alright, you ready? He's gonna go. You see what you Whoa! There you go. Say bye, fish. Can you say bye? Say bye. See you later, dude. <laughs> Good job. Well, that wasn't too bad. Hey, you weren't lying. Oh, see? All, all, the, all the. I just had to eat more beef jerky. Yeah. I, I, I housed that whole bag. Pack and a half down one fish. Alright, so we're gonna make we're gonna make an audible now that we know there are fish in this lake. <laughs> What? Are She's you driving? driving? She says, we caught a fish. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> We're ready to get out of here, aren't you? No, we gotta we'll try to catch one more. I want to try to catch one on her rod. The the Guggen rod's obviously great, but it's it's hard for her to reel and hold the rod. I, I really think if I catch a fish on that one, she'll be able to kind of handle better if I can just support the rod. So I'm gonna put a wacky on there, give her a couple wham bams, see what happens. You guys stay tuned. <laughs> Tell me, I'm gonna trade this in. This is the day. You like that thing? Oh yeah. I'm gonna skip docs like a pro. Right on that little break. Mm -hmm. oh, it's gotta be worth something. Oh, oh. We're on. Oh! We're on. We're on. We're on. Oh, dude. I, Brooke, I gotta get it in a little bit more. Okay. The drag oh, is not existed. Oh, on that this thing. thing's. This, oh, it broke. It broke. No. It broke. It broke. That line. There, there's no. There's no drag on this. It broke. That was a freaking mondo, was dude. <laughs> oh my god, it snapped. Dude, the drag. It, you can't even adjust it. Oh Why did my god. for bluegill? Well, <laughs> not a six pounder. All right, get the braid out. We're gonna restring this sucker. <laughs> gosh, dang it, dude. That was a tank, it bro. Was. Oh was my fish. gosh, that was such a big fish. You called it on the cast, right? Dude, I literally was like right on that break. Wham, dang. I just, I, like, I mean, yeah, I guess the only thing I could do next time is I can I can throttle the button. When he when he runs, I can just let him basically let him have it. Just that's the only thing that's, on the line. that's the only thing I'm gonna do next time. Like, <sighs> Alright, now this is personal. We're gonna get one on Moana. I believe in you. Look out. We're on. We're on. Really? I don't know if he knows it took yet, but we got one. Oh my god, it might be bigger than the last. Uh oh. Uh-oh. So you gonna thumb that drag or he's swimming at you? Yeah, he is. Hey Brooklyn, where you at? Right here. Come here, Brooklyn. He gets even close. Get him up. Grab him. Come here, Brooklyn. Here, you want real? You real? 
Here, you hold the rod. No, don't let her hold the rod because she'll put that overboard. Oh, I can't. I, I can't let go of him. Okay, you reel. Okay, go ahead. Here, reel with your other hand. There you go. Reel. Can you reel? Hey, let go. Let go of the button. Here you go. Grab it. Grab it. Reel. Go. 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 Ready? Go. Arr! Oh my God, dude, he's huge. Come on. Good job. Good job. He's coming. He's coming to the surface. There he is. Oh! oh, 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 oh. Good, job. Marco, good job. Keep reeling. Keep reeling, bub. Come on. Did you see him and get scared? What's wrong? It's okay. Come on, buddy. Look. Here, do you want to stand next to Here, you stand up. Ready? We'll watch. He's coming. He's chilling. He's having a good time. You all done fishing? Right you, you may bring him in. Here. Look, we're going to get him. I can't get him to. I can't get the button to release. There it is. It's a tank. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Holy I, smokes. I, I, I'm just, yeah, easy grabbing that line. Just real easy. If it runs, just let it go. Oh God, I'm just barely, he's just kind of floating with it. Easy. There he is. Easy. <laughs> oh! I'm wet. That's a five pounder. That's a big sure. fish, dude. Ow. Easy. <laughs> Easy. Yep, just let her go. She runs. Just let her, let her go. Look at that sucker. Oh Shit. <laughs> Oh, big boy, right here. Right. Oh! Right, right there, there's your grab. There it is! Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! That's a hoss right there, Look at there, it next buddy. to the pole. Wow! Wow! <laughs> Good job, dude! Look at that fish! That's, That's a like big that? one! Yeah, that one didn't break no. off. The old thumb control. Oh what do you think? That's a big old you fish. Feel you feel a fish? Can you, can you pat him? Can you pat him? Nah, he's holding you, you pat him. There you go. <laughs> Look at this sucker. <laughs> wow. Look at that big girl. Yeah. She's hiding. What you, what's wrong? Here, you want to come over here? Go say hi. Here, come here. It's okay. Look, you see his big old mouth? You're not too sure? He's, like, he's too pretty, big. Is he pretty big? Well, yeah, let's not gouge him out, but yeah, good job. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. You see his tongue? Can you see it? I don't know. You want me put him back in the water? You do? Okay. She goes, yep. <laughs> yep. Dude. <laughs> Easily five on the Big old oh, fish. Yeah. That's that's chunk right there. On Moana too. Yeah. You can't give up on Moana. He's gotta know how to he's gotta know how to deal with it, okay? Big Sheila goes for a run. You came back for a little bit more? Do you want me to put him back in the water? Or do you wanna keep petting him? You can't breathe, so can't what do you think? Breathe. Put him back. She put him back in the water. Yeah, his, it's in his mouth. <laughs> she's, she's like, there's a worm in his mouth. Yeah, we know. All right, we're gonna get him unhooked. Okay. We'll get him back in the water. Sheesh. Good job, Brooklyn. That's awesome. All right, we're gonna release him. Can you say bye? Bye. All right. <laughs> See you later. See you later, dude. He's gonna jump. Oh. Whoa. You say bye. See you later, fish. Well, Moana pulled through, boys. Caught one on my Guggen rod, no problem. Moana got busted off with one that's probably about that big, maybe even a little bigger, it's kind of tough to say. We just had a feather a little bit, had to hit that, hit the button, since there's no adjustable drag. But we got her done, did, and Brooklyn actually reeled, helped reel that fish in. She could feel it, which was pretty cool. But it is difficult catching these big old fish with this light, with this light gear, but I'd say for a first bass, for a first bass, I don't think you're gonna break that for a while. Yeah, is the fish is in the water, bud. We said bye bye. Yeah, bye bye. Yeah, that's that's gonna be broken to be for probably quite some time. Shoo! Well, hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Brooklyn catching her very first fish ever, and it was a giant bass, probably pushing like five pounds. So it was pretty fun to take her out there. I think she she liked it. The thing with kids is it's kind of like a keep it short and sweet kind of thing. Make sure they're having fun. Don't let them get too bored. Um, but anyways, hopefully you guys, if you guys checked out uh, the jerky, by the time you watch this video, it's probably gone. Uh, so I wanna say huge thanks to you guys for supporting it. And like I said at the beginning of the video, we've got new flavors and new bags coming soon in August. We're shooting for like the second or third week in August. We can't reveal a date yet because we don't know when the, the manufacturer gonna have it all in. But we're gonna have brand new merch, brand new bundles, bigger savings, and new flavors. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and peace.